What a jam-packed day we've had here so far. We got Warzone 2.0 and Modern Warfare 2 all ready, good to go. But finally, we're hitting something new here. Coming into mobile, we got Warzone Mobile 2 here for you. It's me, Beef Mommy, and I couldn't be more excited to be here with none other than Chris Plummer. And Chris, what do you have for us today? That's right. Today we are proud to introduce Call of Duty Warzone Mobile. Yeah. This is the real thing and it's on your phone. For the first time ever, you can drop into Call of Duty Warzone from wherever life takes you. Let me quickly point out the gameplay you're seeing today, it's still alpha, so it's only gonna get better. And for Warzone fans, you will recognize this drop sequence right away. I mean, honestly, it just gives me so much nostalgia, but wait a minute, Chris, is that the legendary Verdask? You know, this is where Warzone gameplay was born. And we're bringing the legendary Verdansk map to mobile for the very first time from its hallmark vistas in these dense urban areas. They're just so much fun to play in. Wide open fields, ready for battle. And in intimate, close quarters, combat environments. There's so much variety in Verdansk. It's famous for good reason teaming with fan favorite locations like Boneyard and Superstore, even TV station. Well, I'm getting classic Call of Duty Warzone flashbacks here. Can you tell us more about the gameplay? Or, you know what, maybe just give me your phone real quick. Maybe I can see for myself. No? <laughs> you know, the team has a passion for delivering the most authentic Call of Duty experience possible for mobile devices. From the way you aim and move to the weapon handling and the control responsiveness, all these critical little details combined to make Call of Duty Warzone Mobile feel best in class. We've made sure that the physics, the feedback, the sights and sounds, all those essential little touches are smooth and accurate. It's about creating an experience that's so true to form, you can imagine feeling that dirt compressing under the soles of your boots with every move. Or imagine those tiny shock waves of recoil moving through your entire body with every shot. In Warzone Mobile, these are the kind of details that we care about that make the combat feel airtight and authentic. That makes me really emotional, Chris. And you know, it sounds like everyone's paying attention to detail and it's finally paying off. Now, when I think of Call of Duty Warzone, I think about strategy. Absolutely. There's a lot more going on than pure gunplay. For example, when you're out there exploring a the map and evading the gas circle collapse, you can try to sneak up on another player and pull off a finishing move. It's like ultimate bragging rights. And if you're feeling more strategic, you and your squad, they can complete contracts, use that cash at buy stations. There's a ton of variety there, including lots of different abilities like bringing back a fallen squad mate. Now, that contract economy, it adds a ton of depth and strategy through risk and reward. I really like that you brought that up because if you're talking about risk and reward, I think about the kill streaks. I think about the gulag. Are they going to be there too? Yes. <laughs> Everything you come to expect from Warzone, it's going to be there, especially kill streaks. This means you can deploy your big stick of choice like, you know, a precision airstrike. You might be able to wipe out an entire squad with it. So, not so fortunate for them, but they're not necessarily down for the count either because we have the gulag. So here players can fight for a second chance. So when you go down, you get to fight one-on-one -on -one with another down player, and you can earn your way back into battle. This is how Warzone Mobile plays out on a truly massive scale, unlike anything we've ever played on mobile before. For this reason, we're pushing way past the envelope on high player counts to make sure each match is jam-packed with our signature style of combat. So we are supporting up to 120 live players in the single match. Wait, 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 hold on. Did you just say 120 players? Or do you mean bots? Because it seems like in Battle Royale games on mobile, they're usually loaded up with boring bots. Well, we believe it's critically important and a lot more fun to play with real, live, human opponents. And that is our focus. So for anyone who's tired of playing with nothing but bots, we hear you. We're talking up to 120 real players ready to hunt you down with real human skill and real human emotions. That is Call of Duty Warzone Mobile. And we hear you in the crowd. Everyone's excited and absolutely it is huge. And I don't think there's a game on mobile that can top that in terms of real player count, of course. But how are you able to even pull that off? 
we can support real player counts at dramatically higher scale than we've ever seen in other Battle Royale games on mobile because Warzone Mobile is running on advanced, unified Call of Duty technology. This is the same shared tech behind the console and PC versions of Warzone 2.0. It gives us a ton of advantages, like these incredibly high player counts, authentic Call of Duty combat and gameplay systems, and it opens the door to a much more connected experience across all platforms. So when you say more connected, does that mean that Warzone Mobile will share content and features that will be in the console and PC version of Warzone 2.0? Exactly. Delivering a deeply connected experience has been a strategic pillar from the beginning of development. Now, we know that your time is precious and your investment in playing is now recognized across Modern Warfare 2, Warzone 2.0, and Warzone Mobile. So wherever you're playing Call of Duty, it is time well spent, including on mobile. Even your friends list and chat are shared across platforms, so you can stay in touch with your friends, whether they're playing on console or PC or mobile, wherever they choose to play. I mean, that is so exciting. I totally get that. Now, one of the coolest benefits of having this kind of connectivity is that Call of Duty Warzone Mobile is loaded up with the same authentic Call of Duty weapons and operators you'll recognize from Modern Warfare 2 and Warzone 2.0. And whatever you get from the Battle Pass, you will see it on console or PC, it'll also be there on your mobile device too. And the other way around works as well. I really love to hear that. And as a matter of fact, I saw some of the same weapons and operators being shown earlier today in Call of Duty Warzone 2.0. Are you aiming to make it exactly the same on all platforms? You know, that's a great question. See, the team's incredibly excited about how deeply connected and authentic the experience is in Call of Duty Warzone Mobile. And we'll continue to adapt the best content and features and innovations created across the franchise. But at the same time, we recognize that mobile is a very unique platform. Mobile has its own flavor, advantages, and player expectations. Sounds like the game will be tied into the Call of Duty franchise pretty nicely. And will there be mobile-specific events or content that is unique to Warzone Mobile? Yes. Above all else, the team is committed to ensuring Warzone Mobile is a world-class, mobile-first experience right down to its core. Controls are a huge part of it. It just needs to feel natural on the device, intuitive and you know native to the platform. A lot of it comes down to tuning. And this is why we are supporting synchronous crossplay between iOS and Android platforms exclusively on mobile. And we're avoiding the imbalance that comes with crossplaying between mobile devices and consoles or mobile to PC. This allows our teams to deliver the best possible mobile gameplay experience with a unified feel. And by doing this, we don't need to compromise the tuning for any platform. This ensures a level playing field and more fun for everyone. Now, keeping those controls balanced for all player types, it's super important. So whether you're the hardest of hardcore mobile pros, or maybe you're a console first player that's sneaking in an extra match during your lunch break, even brand new players to the franchise who need a little help getting into the flow of the game, we are committed to providing the most robust control options anywhere for a pick up and play experience that's accessible to all of our players. I love that accessibility and that means all my friends can get in on the action for a change, but how do they sign up? <laughs> well, it's time to get your mobile devices ready because I'm super excited to announce that starting right now, you can pre-register for your free download in the Google Play Store. Signing up means that you can be among the first to play when the game launches next year. We look forward to seeing everyone in Call of Duty Warzone Mobile. <sighs> With that being 